Hi, I'm Carol. I'm sure, like me, your child's health means everything to you. Liam, our 10-year-old son, is the centre of our lives. One day recently, I noticed Liam was just not himself and I got quite worried, so I called our doctor. While we were talking, Dr O'Reilly had Liam's electronic patient records at his fingertips. Based on my son's previous medical history and current symptoms, he knew his condition was serious. He advised me to go to the Children's Hospital of Ireland Emergency Department immediately. When we got to the emergency department, I was relieved I didn't have to answer several questions again and again relating to Liam's detailed symptoms or previous medical history. They had all of Liam's records already there, even the symptoms I had described earlier on the phone. The emergency department doctor, Dr O'Brien, proceeded to order tests for Liam. Soon after, a nurse arrived to take a sample of Liam's blood. The nurse took the sample, barcoded the container and sent it to the lab. She told me that she and Dr O'Brien would receive Liam's results to their smartphones as soon as they were entered into the system from the lab. I was amazed at how quickly we received the results back. As Dr O'Brien was prescribing medication for Liam, an alert appeared on the system indicating a medication contraindication because of an allergy. It was great to know that Liam's allergies were already noted on the system without me having to tell anyone at the hospital that day. Dr O'Brien then made the decision to transfer Liam to one of the inpatient wards. And when we arrived at the inpatient ward, Liam's room was ready and the nurses and doctors were waiting for him. On questioning one of Liam's doctors regarding his medication, I was comforted to see that I didn't have to worry about my son receiving another patient's pills or an incorrect dosage because the new barcode medication system automatically alerts the caregivers if there are any errors. A few days later, Liam was stable. We were really fearful to learn that Liam had diabetes, but because he was able to communicate with other children who had diabetes on social networking sites using the in-room edutainment, he was the one who was able to reassure us that everything was going to be all right. So he doesn't feel alone and knows he will have a normal life. Later that week, we were really impressed with the edutainment console, available to watch educational and clinically relevant videos specifically developed for kids in Ireland with diabetes. I was also surprised to hear about all the new potential new treatments and drugs for kids that might help with diabetes and recurrent symptoms. The EPR automatically identifies if a patient is a candidate for these potentially life-changing innovative treatments. Looking to the future, it's fantastic that from my laptop, I can schedule all my son's post-discharge clinic visits to happen on the one day. And it's great to know that Liam's doctor and caregivers have access to all the results and notes from these appointments immediately as well via the electronic patient record. Technology now really is amazing. My son now has a glucophone which wirelessly transmits his daily blood sugar measurements to his doctors. What's great is the EPR automatically identifies and generates alerts if an abnormal trend appears. So neither Liam or I need to worry about it. The EPR does all the work and we can go on with our normal lives. This is not the end of our story, but really the beginning. The beginning of learning to live with diabetes and working with our multidisciplinary team of caring doctors, nurses and allied health professionals to ensure Liam lives his life to the fullest. I can honestly say that because of the new electronic patient record integrated with the Children's Hospital of Ireland, Liam has been the centre of the caregiver's attention from the outset and continues to be the centre of ours.